Hello! Welcome once again, Denobi2 here, to another visual tour. This time we're going to be reviewing the Hot Toys Red Snapper. The uh, part of the Power Pose series. This is the second one in the series. And I was not going to do a visual tour on this one, but since I saw uh, that other folks weren't um, filming it in the daylight and showing how beautiful this figure looks in the daylight, I said, what the heck, it's a little bit late, but uh, I, I think I can, you know, do some justice and show what the colors look like uh, in the daylight, uh, since everyone else seems to be doing it inside their house. And that might kind of give me the advantage. Beautiful figure, beautiful figure. Part of the Iron Legion, uh, the House Party Protocol, the Red Snapper, gorgeous figure. Now, I was uh, I was very well impressed with the amount of articulation that uh, they included with the Power Pose, considering that the first edition Power Pose, the Mark 42, uh, was not that uh, was not that articulated. Uh, so they're giving a little bit more bang for the buck, considering that the sticker price on this one. It's, it's up there. It's it's um about it, it's averaging you know about 250 bucks from Sideshow and other retailers. So um, you know it's 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 a lot. It's a lot for the power of considering that the Mark IV is only about 64. That's what I paid for. Uh, let's get right down to it. Let's play around with some of this articulation. Uh, it, I didn't find it too difficult to pose the figure. Um, I was actually pretty impressed by it. I like it. I was kind of blown away by this and uh, how uh, detailed and I mean for, for the power post like I said I the only thing I can compare this to is to the mark 42 which uh, which was released uh, uh, earlier since this is the second one now the red snapper suit I believe it's a bomb extraction suit it was designed by Tony Stark to handle uh, bombs that right there is the light switch for the head uh, I was actually impressed that even in the daylight, it, uh, the lies are still lit up. Back panel here snaps right off. That's actually pretty easy. On and off button. Uh, I I love how the arc reactor glows. Beautiful. Kind so what makes the Red Snapper Hot Toys figure so unique are the interchangeable parts. So if you happen to have extra Iron Man suits, uh, like I do, you can mix and match parts. Uh, I found this part kind of pretty neat. And the creations that you can do are, are pretty interesting since there is about 42 suits in the collection and how uh, Hot Toys will um, take our money. This is interesting right here. Check this guy out. Does he, uh, does he look familiar? Well, heck, he should. It's the Peacemaker suit. Yes. Paint him in yellow. It's the exact same figure. That'll be another $250. Shane? Yes, this is what I'm talking about, guys. The out of controlness of a uh, Hot Toys. Now, it, it's not a bad thing, but I mean, for crying out loud, it is the Peacemaker. Just paint them in yellow. Another 250 bucks. I'm assuming it'll be another another Power Pose figure, but my God, talk about getting beat up on the wallet here. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> um. It's not going to stop me. I, I know it's starting to bug a lot of the collectors in the industry, and the big consensus is uh, if you don't like, if you don't want to collect it, you don't have to buy. It. Well, it's not. It's easier said than done. Does this guy look familiar? Well, hell, he should. <laughs> it's a South Palm. Paint him in gray. Boom. Another two hundred fifty bucks. Actually, no, probably three hundred. <laughs> yeah, you see those dollar bill signs starting to come in now. <laughs> Yes, if you want the complete collection, one through 42, you will pay. Thank God there's not a version of this guy with the uh, with the two arms. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hot Toys, what are you gonna do to me? Now, is it really Hot Toys or is it really the studio? I mean, did any, any of you suspect Iron Man 3 as a big cash cow merchandise? I mean, 42 suits for crying out loud. That's a crap load of suits to, uh, to collect. And I'm sure they strategically did that on purpose. What do you guys think? I, I I keep I keep using the phrase out of control because it, it really is. And I'm not gonna stop collecting. I, I really am not. I, I love Iron Man. But uh, maybe pace it out a little bit, you know, slower. Uh, bury myself in more payment plans. I don't know. Like, subscribe, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think uh, uh, about what I discovered. Let me go ahead and turn off this little light here.
Thanks, guys. Hope to do another one.